I've been rising my distance The moon and my bone and commitment My nights have been falling, I feel it Searching for loss of a feeling Ties that I'm lost, I don't miss it Don't cry me, I ain't no big bitch Ties have been rising my distance The moon and my bone and commitment What is going on, my concise conversation family? Long time no see I hope you guys are all doing well I'm doing great I'm on spring break. I am in Hayward, California, uh, enjoying my spring break because school was rough. School was super rough. But today I wanted to just film a quick video, um, really wrapping up season two of Concise Conversation. It has been a very long season. I've been doing it for a while, so I uh, definitely got tired near the end, especially with finals and just life and school. and everything else um, definitely slowed down but now that I'm on spring break I want to pick it back up and really start creating content again and figuring out where I want the direction of this channel to go and that's very exciting so I'm grateful for that opportunity um, so this season finale of season season two is going to be an episode about gratitude and the importance of gratitude um, because I've really just seen it develop in my personal life and how how much you get back by being gracious and having a grateful attitude. Um, I remember seeing this thing on Twitter one day and it was like a chart of different emotions and how they uh, quantify, I guess you could say, into feelings and how you feel. Um, and gratitude was right at the top of the list. Um, when you show gratitude, it literally makes you feel good. and. Um, the, the consistency of showing gratitude, I feel like, makes it easier to be grateful for the little things. Like, for example, one example. Uh, so right now, I drove up to the, I drove up to the bay two, two days ago with uh, three of my homies. And um, once I got up to the bay, I realized that I forgot all my shoes. And these chanclas are the only shoes I have, you know? And all my friends were like, how you forget your shoes, this and that, you know? It happens, you know, and I, I noticed that the first thing I said was, was, well, at least I have my chanclas, you know, and that was just a little thing that, you know, I self-reflected on that I have gotten to the point where I feel like I show gratitude even for the smallest things. Um, so I think that's the point that I feel like everyone should work toward, you know, because we, we spend a lot of time focusing on the things that we don't have. Um, we don't have a lot of money. We don't have a lot of land. We don't have property, like all these things that we don't have. And... I think it's super easy to focus on the, all those negative things when you know you can look at the other side of the spectrum and look at all the things that you do have. And I think once you realize all the things you do have, you'll yeah be grateful and realize that you know life could be a lot worse. And just because life can be a lot worse doesn't mean that you know just because we say that life can be a lot worse doesn't mean that we're we're minimizing the struggles that we're currently going through. I don't think that's the purpose of gratitude i think the pur purpose of gratitude is looking at all the things you can control all the things that you have all the things that you have to be thankful for and taking all of those things and trying to move forward rather than really being stuck in the past and being stuck in the have not mentality of what you don't have because what is the point of you know harping on what you don't have when you have all the right freedom and you know agency to go get what you want you know so I'd rather be grateful for the ability to go get what I want and go live out my dreams instead of, you know, getting in this spiral of what I don't have. Because honestly, that's not doing anything for anyone. In fact, that's, I feel like that's hurting you more than it is helping you. So um, throughout this whole quarter, this whole winter quarter, um, and really throughout this whole journey of my YouTube channel, Concise Conversation, um, I have really just been grateful for the whole opportunity because this is not an opportunity opportunity that everyone gets, you know. It's an opportunity that everyone has available to them, but it's not an opportunity that everyone has the drive, the the courage, or the motivation to like actually pursue. And I'm glad that I get to wake up every day and do this. And this is exactly what I want to do with my life and expand it and watch it grow as I grow and bring people along with me on the journey. 
So, um, this is going to be a short episode. I hope you guys are all doing well. Um, I'm doing great. I'm definitely enjoying my time here in the Bay Area. Um, yeah, definitely take some time. Have some self-compassion self -compassion for yourself and some patience. There's a lot going on right now, and people's lives are very hectic. But um, I think the theme of this is just to be grateful, you know. Be grateful for, for what you have and be grateful for the opportunity to go get what you don't have. So... With that being said, I hope you guys are all doing well today and you continue to be well and I will catch you later. Peace out.